Officers are on scene. Oh, Roger. Viv, thank you very much for coming in. We've had a string of carjacking similar to yours in the area, and we just figured a detailed sketch would help us find our guy. I'm happy to help. Our sketch artist called in sick today, but uh, thankfully, one of us happens to be quite the artist. <laughs> oh. Okay. Uh, I figured since I did those summer art intensives at the Pratt Institute, that I would handle the sketch. Well, I'm kind of known for my doodle, so maybe we just both do it. Two heads are better than one. Thank you, Viv. This should be interesting. Viv, why don't you give me a detailed description of the suspect? Okay, um, male, in his 30s, white. He was wearing a hoodie, and it obscured part of his face, but I could see that he had facial hair. Stop. Mustache or full beard? Full beard. And what color was the hoodie? Blue, but not like a navy blue, more like a sky blue. Okay, great. I actually only have the Sharpie, but it's good to keep it in your imagination. Okay, I'm done. Mahoney? Mm, pause. Done. Viv, is this the man who stole your car? Mm, I don't... Oh, <gasps> that's him! That? You, you're serious? Can you just give me a second? I never thought I would come face to face with him again. Take your time. I'm gonna go ahead and send this to forensics. We should send both, right? <laughs> no, we should not. <gasps> Wait, he had a tattoo on his wrist. I saw it when he pulled the gun. Okay, go ahead and describe it when you're ready. Wait! <sighs> go. It was a skull with a snake coming out of one of the eye sockets. Stop. Right eye or left eye? Snake's right or my right? Snake's. Then left. Thank you. And what kind of a snake? A copperhead. I actually don't know snakes, just curious. My grandpa had to kill one with a hoe once. Really? Okay, done. Mahoney, done? Good. Viv, is this the tattoo? Kinda? Kinda? Yeah, kinda. Could I see? <gasps> That's it. Are you shitting me? It's like you pulled it right from my memory. Did you notice the hiss I put yes. on top? Let me go ahead and send this one to forensics. Let's send no. both. Trying to solve a case here. Okay, you know what? Viv, uh, I think you might still be in shock. Really? Yep, you're in shock, definitely. So why don't you start from the beginning, before he jumped out of the van, everything, details, go. Okay. Wait! Like I said before, I was walking to my car and this van just speeds up out of nowhere. It's one of those work vans and it's got a decal of some kind sort of painted onto the side. Stop. Describe it. Okay, yeah, it was a unicorn fighting a Bengal tiger and in the background there's a volcano erupting and you know, lava is spewing everywhere and the passenger's door it said Jeff's Plumbing. Stop. Love it. Continue. Well, so he kicked open the passenger's door and he, he ran out. And he, he came up to me and he pulled the gun. He had the hood on and the beard. And then he puts the gun in my face and he says, Give me your keys, bitch! I don't know if you know what it feels like to be a woman and be called bitch. It's really horrible. So he got in my car and he drove away. And that, that's pretty much it. I think you mean this is pretty much it. This is it. Right, Viv? This is the picture. Right? No. Shot in the dark. It. What? Just want to let you guys know, we caught the guy. <gasps> oh my god. Thanks to you. You have a real gift. Oh, well, thank you very much, Detective. Could I keep that? I would love for you to have it. Yours could probably be recycled. Oh, 